Ladies and gentlemen, a rewarding 2023 has come to pass, leaving us with many life-defining memories. And now, the mighty hand of God swings open the portals of another new year, 2024. As we enter upon this threshold, the 108,000 members of Central Jamaica Conference stand grateful, expectant, and repositioned for more. We thank our Heavenly Father for his faithfulness to us and the abundant blessing that he has lavished upon us. Despite the economic challenges, uh, the crime and the violence that affect our brothers and sisters and our nation, and the numerous ills that have plagued our nation and our people, our brethren, the promises of God are sure. He sustained us. He stood by us. He was there for us at all times. He supported us individually. He supported our families, and he supported the church. And for this, we give God the praise and the honor for his goodness to us as a church, as a people, and as a nation. The administration and directorate of Central Jamaica Conference are grateful for God, to God for you as members of the church and our workers for your dedication and commitment to the mission which we are called here in Central Jamaica Conference. We thank God for you and for what you have done. As a result of your effort today, we can say thanks to God for over 2,300 precious souls have surrendered their life to him as a result of your exploit in evangelism and your commitment to the mission. Also, we have seen over 20% increase in our tithe and offering as a result of the faithfulness of the members and their generosity. And for that, we give God the praise and the honor for a successful 2023. We pledge to stay focused on our mission here in Central Jamaica Conference. I will go reposition for more in 2024. More mission, more opportunity, more relationship, and more empowerment. This is what we do, and we're committed to that as we seek to share the everlasting gospel with men and women around the world. As we seek to impact the lives of men and women, as we seek to educate and empower the minds of our people, we are going for more in 2024. This, my brothers and sisters and ladies and gentlemen, will not be accomplished by mere human effort, regardless of how strong we are, how intelligent we are, and all the skill set that God has given us. That alone is not enough. We have to ensure that we are immersed by the Spirit of God, that the Spirit of God empowers us guide us and lead us as we carry forward the mission in 2024. This year, we are repositioned to relational responsibility. The Inter-American Division, along with Jamaica Union Conference, Seventh-day Adventists, and us here in Central Jamaica Conference, we are committed to uh, all the Family in Mission initiative because we believe that as we pray together, and as we study together, we can transform the lives of men and women, and we can build up the kingdom of God. This initiative is a prayer-powered program to lead our families and our communities back to a saving relationship with Jesus Christ at the altar. And so we implore everyone to get on board as we seek to achieve this. Uh, 2,500 couples each couple working with at least two couples, befriending those individuals, share the love of Jesus Christ with them. And 7,000 single individuals 
working with at least two singles, loving them, caring for them, praying with them, and pointing them to Jesus Christ. That's what we're about in 2024 as we go for more. Let us embrace the dawn, therefore, of this new year that God has given to us with Christian hope. My brothers and sisters, our goals will be achieved if we place them in the hand of Almighty God. Our relationship will get better as we seek to pray together, study together, and fellowship one with the other. Our health may not be the best now, but it will improve if we exercise that faith in God, knowing that He can heal, He can deliver, and He can change our lives. My brothers and sisters, my wish and prayer for you is that as we go through this year, our soul will be anchored in the Lord because we seek to emulate Him. And I pray that by the grace of God, when Jesus comes, all of us will hear the well done word from the lips of our Savior. God bless you. Happy New Year from Central Jamaica.